Okay, uh, this is a tutorial for jumping jacks. I'm only doing this because Snipers44 did request this in the comments of that trick. Uh, so I guess I'll do it. If y'all guys want to see tricks, I will try to learn them uh, and post them when it, on Saturdays and tutorials on Wednesdays. That is the official time I will be uh, doing it. So, video Saturday, tutorials Wednesday, and it's Wednesday, so here's the tutorial. I'm using the uh, reverse back deck. Uh, you see that the face cards are here. Here's just the. Here's just some cards. I will go ahead and throw this in the middle. Uh, like always, links will be in the description. I lost the box, that's why you do not see it right now. So uh, let's get to it. First, you want to turn the deck upside down with the four jacks out. You can have the spectator shuffle it, then pull out the jacks, or pull out the jacks, then have the spectator shuffle it. Either which way it works. I prefer to have the spectator shuffle it then pull out the jacks. Uh, I recommend doing black, red, black, red, red, black, red, black. It just looks better. But what you want to do is, I'll turn it to the camera in a second. What you want to do is you want to have it like here. So you go ahead and act like you're pushing it in all the way, but don't. And slide the top few cards toward you, or away from you, over the jacks as you're doing it, so it looks like you're completely pushing it in. And do a Hindu shuffle. By doing that, you have now successfully gotten the four jacks. Oh. Oh, I messed up. Uh, don't do it like that. The jack is in the middle. One of them is. Uh, sorry about that guys, I will, oh it wasn't that far off, but uh, use a bit of misdirection and just see if you can look at the top four cards before you do it, if not just go, you can either A, say you messed up, or B, go and do another trick using two decks, I'm not sure which, how you'll do that, but it's up to you, but uh, once you do have the top four, the four jacks on top, oh, you do need to know four, at least three color changes. You can do four if you want, but I only do three in the trick, as you saw in the video. Uh, you go ahead and riffle down, have a spectator tell you when to stop. You have them look at it, and as they're inspecting it, you catch a pinky or flush break, you go with one, but you use a pinky break, it's just easier. And that sets you up for the double lift. And you do a color change. I always start with the shape shifter. Uh, you have the audience member inspect the card, hold it if they want, or you can set it down. Here's the card that you just changed, and so they know you're not cheating. Don't tell them that this is the card, but uh, you, you just go ahead and slide it right in the middle and carry on with the trick. Have a spectator pick the card again. Uh, as you're set it on top, as you're picking it up, you can catch a flush break, or you can go back to having them look at it and catching it there. Uh, I do the shapeshifter next, which is just that. Set it down. Like always, go ahead and set, it, set the card in the middle without showing it. Third jack, you can either A, go ahead and have them pick a card again. Say what? We're, uh, I'd, if I were to do it like this, I'd do the Moilo Tilt. Or no, I wouldn't. Hold up, my bad. Uh, don't do that. Don't follow my instructions right there. Uh, catch the pinky break. Set it down. Set it face down. And I do this. Um, I can't get it with this. It's this new deck, newer deck, smooth. But you can do that, or you can just go ahead and, just, or you can just r dribble, riffle through either with one. It's there. And the last one, 
you actually start off with a double lift right there and you do a Cardini change or if you know it, the duck change that works too you know how to set up for the duck change if you know it I do the Cardini because I mean it just looks nice and you could even I think you could even do something like the ego change if you catch the double and go ahead and do it but uh, try not to use other face cards it's just not contrasting it just doesn't give it a big reveal thankfully I got lucky but I do use the Cardini change I just like it sometimes that happens but you do do it uh, 360 square up with the Cardini. The card does end up on bottom. Uh, Sniper S44, hope that helped. Uh, it carry on as addition. And see y'all guys next time. Oh, wait, like, comment, subscribe. Be sure to share because that helps me out a lot. And now, see y'all guys next time. Peace.